We're back at the Birmingham Zoo for another edition of Wild About Animals with the squirrel monkey behind us. I'm very excited about this, but I know nothing about it, and that's why we have Rachel here. Rachel, how are you? Hi, I'm good. How are you? Good. Rachel is new to Birmingham, but not to animals and not to her job here at the Birmingham Zoo. Tell us what we're looking at. The squirrel monkey seems very agile. So these are the squirrel monkeys. As you can tell, they're very small. Some people seem to think that they're babies, but this is actually their full-grown size. They are native to South America, and right now they're having a little bit of a snack. They're mm -hmm. eating wax worms and mealworms. And as you can see, they have very small hands. They're very dexterous, so they're able to manipulate their enrichment that we give them very well, which helps motivate them mentally and physically. And they have a lot of fun with it. They also get browse from here to there. As you can see, they have some bamboo in there right now. Mm -hmm. Now, when I notice their feet, what I would call their feet, look awfully a lot like their hands. Is that, is that unique to the squirrel monkey? It's not unique to them. This is um, something very common in pretty much all primates. Okay. Um, allows them to climb very well. They are an arboreal species, which means they live up in the trees which is why you see them up. You won't find them on the ground too often, but mm -hmm. they do sometimes go down to pick up the food that they've dropped. Is there any significance to the coloring on their arms or their tails or where on their backs? Is that anything significant? It just helps them blend in with the trees when they're up high. Okay. And now, so is their diet exclusively worms or do they eat in the wild other things like that? They eat a lot of fruit and leaves. They'll eat branches um, and they do eat insects from here to there. Okay. Do we know how old these guys are? They are 17 and 12. Wow. Pretty, what's the lifespan for these then? That's pretty old, right? About 25 Interesting. is in captivity. They live a little bit longer in captivity under human care than they would in the wild. Well, they are a star attraction of this section of the zoo. Beautiful animals, too. I mean, really cool. And the uh, person feeding them worms is not typical to the exhibit, but here today, we got to see them up close and personal. Thank you so much for your expertise. You're awesome. Have a good day. All right, you too. And we'll be right back with much more here on the CBS 42 Morning News.